Good morning everyone. How are you all? How are you Jyoti? Fine. Good. I'm also good. I'm fine. How are you doing? What are you doing at house? Okay. Uh, can you tell me what is today's date? Jyoti, what is today's date? 10th of August. 10th of August and the year is 2020. And the day is Monday. You, can you tell me how you spell Monday? M-O-N-D-A-Y, Monday. D-A-Y, day, Monday. And the weather is, is it sunny Jyoti today? No, it's rainy. It's rainy today. It's raining from morning continuously. And let us learn some days of the week. How many days are there in a week? There are seven days in a week. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday and Saturday. Are you learning all the spellings? That's good. Um, Jyoti, while coming, I have seen many things around me. You know things around us. The concept is things around us. Yes. What, what you have seen many things today while coming to school? There are people around and vehicles, yes. cars and on the road. Yes. You have seen uh, living things and non-living non things, things also. So today the concept is things around us but in things around us we learn what are living things and no. non-living things? Jyoti, can you tell me what are living things? Living things that have life and not li living things that doesn't have life. So living things can living things move, grow, eat and drink and reproduce. Example of living things are people, plants and animals. People say we can move. Animals we can move. Uh, plants they give more things for us, right? So can you can you tell me? We see uh, living things. Yes. Example: people, a girl and a boy, a butterfly, plants, flower, uh, animals like lion and a tiger. Non-living things. Non-living things that. So we see many things around like living and non-living things. Uh, the things that have life are called living things. Non-living things that doesn't move on their own, doesn't grow, doesn't eat anything. Uh, they need nothing to grow and move. Yes. They can't move. They cannot move. They cannot reproduce. Nothing. We, they don't move because we have to do the things with non-living things like with a tree with a tree what you can do you know furniture like, furniture, like a table, table chairs and your bed car, uh, cupboards and all that and with the uh, even papers also we can do right the paper comes yes out. and we can construct a house also really and we get a uh, wood pencil. pencil leather hat leathers yes with animal skin we do some leather works and all that Okay, uh, so they don't take any breath, they don't, non living things, they don't take any breath, they don't move, they don't walk like us, but they give many things to us, like uh, with the fruits we can do a jam. jam, pickles, and you know vegetables and fruits we daily we eat, we right? right? Yes, so uh, non living things are like house, house, pencil, a hat, a ship, a car, a kite and a balloon. These are all non-living things because non-living things cannot take a breath. But living things can take, can, can take a breath and they can reproduce many things. Okay? Do you understand this one concept? Living and non-living things? Living things means move, grow. Non-living things do not move and do not grow. grow. And okay. Just take out your book and see what are living things and non-living things. So living things are people, uh, birds, flowers. I mean flowers means a tree, animals. And non-living things are house, pencil, hat, ship, balloon, car, kite. Many things like these markers are also non-living things. The furniture is non-living thing. Fan is a non-living thing. TV is a non-living thing. So take out your book and or draw a picture like what are living things and non-living things. Okay? I'm going to check those things. Bye-bye.